where did I get the name Mocha? Um, I was actually going to name Mocha Snickers. Um, when I got him, I was like so excited I was going to name him Snickers. But then I found out he was a girl. So I was like, well, I think Mocha would be a very cute name for a girl bunny. And then later on, I found out that he was a boy. So, <laughs> yeah, it was kind of a little crazy. When rabbits are little, it's hard to tell if they're a male or a female. So, yeah, he wasn't a girl. <laughs> but I kept the name Mocha anyway, and I think it's a cute boy name. Um, my rabbit has a habit of ripping paper, and she's digging up all her bedding. So, first of all, rabbits do not need bedding on the floor of their cage. That's what a litter box is for. A litter box is to have litter, or some people call it bedding, in the litter box. And that's where they go to the bathroom. The rest of the cage should be um, just plastic or whatever. Um, because, first of all, bedding is a waste of money. You don't need that much. And um, also, it confuses them on where to go to the bathroom. Um... How many pets do I have? Um, two, if you're counting my pets, but we have seven counting all of our pets. Are these my first set of rabbits? Yes. Do I have, did I, did I have a dog? No, I do not have a dog. I've never had a dog. My mom hates dogs, so. Um... Do you live or want to live on a farm? Um, I didn't live on a farm, but we had land for a horse. Um, I think it would be really fun to live on a farm. Um, I love animals and stuff, but um, I probably would only have horses because I'm not a fan of cows or chickens. So, What kind of litter do I use? Oh, I already answered that. How often do I clean my cage? I clean my cage about every other day, although I've let it go. I think I haven't cleaned their cage in four days, but um, that's okay. It's just, I clean it like every other day, just so that it's not messy. It's not that it like absolutely needs to be. Um, and when I clean the cage, I clean the litter box and everything too. What exactly do I feed my bunnies? I feed my bunnies six cups of vegetables a day and unlimited hay. I do not feed pellets because Lulu can't have pellets and the vet said that Mocha's fine not having pellets either. My bunny doesn't like to chew on wood toys, but he loves to eat any kind of paper he can sink his teeth into. Um, some rabbits don't like wood. Like, my rabbits won't really chew on wood unless it's willow sticks. So I would suggest getting some willow sticks and seeing if they'll chew on them. Um, also, they don't really like the sticks, but like the willow balls, they love it. Um, is Why is KT Timothy Hay bad for rabbits? It's not necessarily bad, but pretty much it's not very fresh. And it's been sitting on a shelf for ages. Um, and it's really pokey. It's like the worst quality hay you could ever get for your rabbits. Let's just say, put it that way. Um, how do you know when you have found healthy hay to buy for your rabbit? Um, uh, pretty much, um, I trust some brands. I trust Oxbow, I trust American Pet Diner, I trust Clean Mama's Hay, and, um, I've never given those to my rabbits because um, I buy from a farm, so if you buy hay from a farmer, then make sure it's green and doesn't have alfalfa in it. Um, we're going on vacation, and the only way, the only option is to travel with my bunny Button. But the vet says that rabbits can die from stress, and he is scared on cry rides. Would, what would the best way to travel be for him? The best way to travel with rabbits is the car. Um, it is true, rabbits can die from stress. Um, it's not like they're stressed out and all of a sudden they plop over dead. It's kind of like they stressed out, they won't eat, so their digestive system stops and then they won't poop and they won't eat and then they die. So it can be done, but I personally say if you're going on vacation, 
um, find someone or hire a professional pet sitter to come and pet sit your rabbit or take your rabbit a short distance like 10 miles away to your friend's house and let them watch it at their house. Um, but if you're not gone, if you're gone over a month, then yes, I would take your rabbit with you. But other than that, I would try as hard as I can not to take my rabbit. If I was to get another small pet, what would it be? So I'm thinking they meaning besides rabbits. So another small pet, I'd probably get a guinea pig, but I personally don't really want a guinea pig, but that would be the one I'd get. Um, what advice can you give bunny light lovers like me who've lost their pet rabbit? Um, first of all, I just want to say sorry, your pet rabbit died. Um, Einstein. Um, I've never personally lost a rabbit. Um, Boca and Lulu are my first buddies, so um, I'm really sorry about your loss. And um, I think you just have to realize that rabbits are, it's just part of nature. They're going to die eventually. Everyone's going to die, even me, even you. So um, it's, it can be hard at first, and you're probably going to cry for the next two weeks. But um, yeah. I don't know. Are you planning on getting any more pets? No. Can you travel with rabbits without getting too stressed or scared or getting too hot? Yes, you can. Some rabbits are perfectly fine with traveling, um, but most are really pretty scared. Should I get it spayed or neutered? Yes. Should I get a male or female? Um, doesn't matter. Um, every rabbit has different personality, whether it's a female or male. What breed is the best for being handled? Um, most rabbits, well, I should say pretty much every rabbit hates to be picked up. So don't put that on your must list for a rabbit. And if you want a pet that likes to be picked up, then yeah, rabbit's not for you. Um, how old, oh wait, <laughs> can you bond two male rabbits? Um, yes, it's possible. I think it is a little harder than a male and female bond. Mm, where did I get my rabbits? Um, and what's my favorite breed? I don't have a favorite breed of rabbits. I pretty much like every rabbit, but, um, I got my rabbits from friends, and personally, if I would ever get a rabbit again, I would get it from a shelter. How much did it cost to get my rabbit spayed? Um, it cost me $60 to get mocha neutered and it cost me $240 to get Lulu spayed. Um, it's, that's like a major difference. First of all, males are always cheaper, but I also used a different vet with mocha than I did with Lulu. And personally, I would never go back to that vet again. I've heard pretty bad stories about him and also he's just kind of older and is just like, well... He, I don't know, he's just not experienced with rabbits. But yeah, average spay cost is $100 to $500. Oh, I'm like getting lightheaded, I'm talking so fast. Um, why did you only do videos about rabbits and not your old horse or my cats? Um... I made rabbits, I made videos on my rabbits because they were my pets. And with cats and horses, there are so many different ways people take care of them and so many different play, like reasons. Like when you train a horse, there's so many different ways you can train it. Like we personally trained it like our own personal way, but um, if there's any horse people out there, we used mostly Clinton Anderson, um, but we also did a mixture of other stuff. Um, but some people are totally against him and like Pirelli, so. Yeah, it, it would be really hard to have a su successful horse YouTube video <laughs> channel. Are rabbits an easy pet to have? No, they're like one of the hardest. And I'm not just saying that. They're harder than cats and even dogs. How can you get your rabbit to stop biting or attacking you when you go by their cage? Um, if your rabbit isn't fixed, that would be the reason. If it is fixed, then 
it's probably scared of you because that their cage is their territory. So when you enter it, they're gonna defend themselves. Um, what is a good homemade treat for rabbits? Um, I don't know. I personally think fruit is the best. Uh, 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 uh. How many rabbit toys have I got so far? Because you seem to have a lot. Yes, I do have a lot of rabbit toys. Um, I haven't counted them, so I don't know. But pretty much, I have like three drawers full. So yeah. Um, am I planning on having more pets? No, I think I already answered that. How often should a long, a uh, lion-haired rabbit be groomed? Um, I don't really know if there's like a set day on when you should groom them, but I would say more than once a week. What should you do when you leave the bunnies in care for somewhere else? Um, that's kind of a hard question to answer on a Q&A video, but I'll try to make it as quick as possible. Um, make it as simple as possible, but yet stay on the same routine um, and make sure it's someone you trust. Uh, who did I first get, Mocha or Lulu? I got Mocha first. Um, can I do a room tour? Yes, I can. Um, how do I keep their cages clean all the time? I don't. You should see them right now. They make such a mess. I just make videos, like, the day I clean them out. How many grids did it take to build a CNC condo? Oh, I just counted. It was like 16, 16, 20, 32. Uh, I don't know. I can't remember at the moment. Can you make a video on how to bond your cats and rabbits? I already have one. Mm -mm -mm. I've always wondered what your favorite color was. Um, my favorite color has changed recently. I used to like orange a lot, but now I actually don't even like that color very much. Um, my favorite color at the moment is purple. What is my favorite video that I've made? Um, Oh, I don't know. It changes a lot. Mostly I like the videos that I've spent a long time editing on and filming, but I don't have a certain one. How did Mocha and Lulu react when they were at the vet? Um, Mocha has only gone to the vet a few times, um, and when he did, mostly he wasn't the one being examined, it was Lulu. Um, so when Mocha is not being examined, oops, sorry, that was my foot. Um, it's so funny. We would open the door and he would just run out and he just runs around the room while um, Lulu's being examined. Um, but Lulu, since she's, she's been a little bad a lot, pretty much wide eyes, terrified, hates it. Pretty much every pet hates the vet. <laughs> um, how did I make the base level of my cage step by step and how, much, how did it cost? Um, first we cut the plywood, then we put the linoleum on, and then we put the wood trim around. Um, and I don't remember how much it cost. How did I... Ooh, can I... Can you show some homemade toy ideas? Um, yeah, in a different video. From your experience, do rabbits really smell? No. Can you do a video on how to know if your rabbit is happy in their home? Um, pretty much, if they're happy, you'll see them flopped out a lot. Um, I don't know, I guess, <laughs> I don't know, because some rabbits don't flop, like Lulu doesn't flop, only Mocha does, so, yeah, I don't know. Um, should your rabbits be vaccinated for any diseases? Um, not If you live in the USA, then no, but if you live in, um, like, in the UK or anything, I think over there you do have to get them vaccinated but I'm not sure because I don't live there <laughs> okay sorry I thought someone was here um what are the genders of my rabbits so Lulu is a girl and Mocha is a boy does neutering help extend your rabbit's life yes 
What do I prefer, male or females? Um, I think I already answered that, but both. <laughs> what kind of palettes do I recommend? Oxbow, Adult Rabbit Food, Bunny Basics Tea. I think that's what it's called. Am I planning to have more pets in the future? Yes. What do I do to cover up um, carpet so the bunnies don't pee and poop on it? Um, you could try to get like a huge piece of linoleum to cover your whole room. Um, and then like put something on the edges so it doesn't like curl up. Or um, you could just put an area rug on top so that if they pee and poop on that one, you can just replace it. Who's my favorite rabbit YouTuber? Um, oh, rabbit YouTubers. Uh, so I'm not subscribed to many rabbit people. Um, let's just say, <laughs> I don't know, like, I don't know, like, I'm not subscribed to many, but the people I am subscribed to, um, I like pretty well. I like, um, Budget Bunny, and I also, Ray Girl, I don't remember, Ray Girl, Ray Girl, you know what I mean, Ray Girl. Um, I liked Morgan's Bunnies 101, but she quit. Which I'm really sad, so if you're watching this video, you should come back. Um, I also watch Personal's Buddies, and I really enjoy her videos. Um, do I wear makeup? Yes. Um, would I ever give Mocha or Lulu away to get a baby bunny? No, I would never do that. Ever, 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 ever. And do I still have Sebastian? No. He was a foster rabbit and he got adopted. What types of fruits and vegetables can rabbits have? I'm not going to list those all because that would be a lot. So you can PM me, well, private message me if you want to know. Can you do a video? Whoa, it's so weird. My bracelet's magnetic to my computer. Okay, anyway. Uh, can I do a video? to tell me some books on rabbits you may recommend. Yes. How much have I spent in, on my rabbits in one year or in a month? I already said how much I do in a month, but in a year, let's just say a lot, counting vet bills and toys and yeah. Which rabbit is most easy to take care of, Lulu or Mocha? Um. Mocha is easier to take care of just because he's never had a health problem. Um, but they're both equally messy <laughs> and they both need food, they both need water, so yeah. Uh, what flooring do I use for my X-Pen? Um, I use a fleece blanket and my rabbit's trying to pull it out. Okay, so I use a tarp at the moment, um, but I've also used a rug, um, and I do use fleece, and my rabbits try to pull it out. So I just try to put the X-Pen on top of the fleece so that it's held down by the X-Pen. Um, is it hard taking care of bunnies? Yes. Where did I get all of the info? Uh, BinkyMoney.com and the House Rabbit Society. How are Lulu and Mocha? They are doing good. What do... <laughs> okay, this is funny. So my sister commented on my video and she asks, what do my sisters think about my rabbits? Um, so if you're watching this, <laughs> um, yeah. So I have two sisters, um, Becca and Kana. And Becca's my oldest sister and she currently doesn't like live with us because she moved out, but she's terrified of Lulu. Um, <laughs> I think it's so hilarious. Um, she's terrified of her because she loves, Lulu loves to be pet, so when you walk in the cage, she'll like dive for your feet because she wants to be pet, and then if you don't pet her, she'll nibble at your toes. So she's terrified of Lulu, but she, she likes Mocha. <laughs> um, and Kana, I don't know. They don't necessarily ever look at my rabbits, so I don't know. What do you think of it, Kana? <laughs> Uh, do I pay for all the bunny stuff or do your parents help me, um, help you, <laughs> sorry. My parents help me with, um, they pay for all necessities 
food, litter, water, whatever, except for cages. I have to pay for all the cages and housing. Um, pretty much anything they don't need, I have to pay for, except for the cage. Um, can you tell me stuff about chicks? I've never had chickens and probably never will, so sorry. And that's it. So yeah, that was a really long video. And I hope you guys liked it. Um, I was kind of nervous that this video would be really weird because I normally edit a lot, so this video probably won't be edited. But yeah, I wasn't really looking at the camera most of the time. I was looking at the screen, so sorry about that. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching, and I will have new videos soon. I already have um, a video half filmed that I'm going to be uploading soon. So keep an eye out for that, and I'll see you later. Bye!